Okay guys, we're at the airport. It is pretty busy. We're waiting for our driver. We'll know it's him because he's gonna have our name. But while we wait, I'm gonna grab us some Starbucks because you know I love my Starbucks. <laughs> guys yet where I was going unless you read the title I am in Argentina when traveling to Argentina it takes about 10 hours and 51 minutes if you're leaving from New York City they flew out two different bands a band for Friday night and a band for Saturday night and I'm in the band that's Saturday night so I have two free days here in Argentina to do whatever I like and then the next day is our gig and we leave Sunday. The band that is on Saturday night is they flew out 18 musicians from around the world and I am so lucky to be one of those 18 musicians. We are in Buenos Aires driving to the hotel. I could see how busy the city was. It felt so like everything was in walking distance and our hotel room feels like a little apartment. Because it is sectioned into two living areas. You have the bedroom, then you have the common room, a little balcony, and a bathroom. As soon as we got to our hotel room, we dropped off our stuff and we all went to go eat lunch at this place called Gia. I'm probably messing up the name. And boy, was it beautiful. It was in a castle because a lot of the hotels here are placed within castles. It was a plant-based restaurant and it was magnificent. We got so much variety within our food. Tonight we're going to the Four Seasons. I'm just so excited to be here and I'm so excited to experience it with you guys. So let's go explore. <laughs> Tonight we're eating dinner at the Four Seasons. It is now our second day and it is another free day. So of course we wanted to explore more. We went to go walk around the city and we found this beautiful church. And of course I had to say a prayer while I was there. Afterwards we went and checked out the Urban Mall to do a bit of shopping for souvenirs before we went back to the hotel to rest and get dressed for dinner. Dinner was amazing. It was so nice to have authentic Argentinian food. We had bone marrow, intestines, steak tartare, you name it, we had it because in Argentina, they eat the entire animal. The restaurant we ate at was located in the city La Paloma. We even celebrated a birthday. I loved every aspect of this trip, especially the food. But if I had to choose one part that was my absolute favorite, it would be when we got to walk and drive around with the tour guide to learn all about Argentina and its history. Our first stop, the second most beautiful bookshop in the world. It's actually placed in a theater. Actually, the beginning of the 20th century, 50% of the population of Haiti were immigrants and mostly 50%, a lot. Right. That means neoclassical architecture. And you will see this in churches like the cathedral, the main Catholic church, neoclassical, universities, faculties, also built in neoclassical style. I saw 
song Lil Out because that's it. Our trip is over. Today we went on a tour, which you probably saw some clips of, and now we're all in the lobby getting ready to go. But I wanted to say bye in Argentina before we left. Okay, guys, I'm Lillian, and I'll see you soon.